Hey there everyone, we're going to take a look at this radar in the F-18 in Flasim X. I'll use my left menu function display to show you this. Go to menu and the uh, radar button and here we got a display of our radar. There's actually two targets there have been found. This is a forward looking radar and this is essentially a top down view of the situation. Alright, so on the right hand side here, or sorry, the bottom right hand side, we've got my altitude. Currently, I'm about four seven thousand four hundred and twenty feet. Actually, I might pause this just so don't get too confused of what's going on. This number here is the, uh, the sweep angle of the radar. So currently, a hundred forty degree sweep angle, which is pretty wide, and that can be um, reduced right down to 20 degree gives you a bit more of a detailed scan I'll keep down about 40 and on my left here is the um, your aircraft speed in Mac Mac 0.8 I'm at the moment and that's 465 knots indicated airspeed up here we have um, this is just the radar mode range while scanning that can't be changed this is the vertical beam pattern even though you can change that it has no um, doesn't make any difference to the radar itself this number over here this is the range the depth I guess of the radar um, how far it's looking so 80 nautical miles is at so far I can reduce the 40, 20, 10, 5 nautical miles. So yeah, so that's how far the radar is looking ahead. So and, and you got these uh, increments on the side here. So if that's 80 up the top there, then that's 40 here. That's 20. That's 60. So this target here is at about. Um, if that's 20 there, then that's going to be about um, 26, 27 nautical miles sorry about 16, 17 nautical miles ahead of me now the, this here, T up, T down, target up, target down that cycles through the targets on the screen so I've got this one here selected at the moment gives you a bit of information on it on the left here 0 0.4 that's its max speed on the right there, 8, that's its altitude in thousands of feet. So currently it's at 8,000 feet. And that little line heading off the square, that's the direction the aircraft's traveling in. So currently it's traveling towards me and heading off to my right a bit. So your aircraft is basically down the bottom here in the center. Look at this other aircraft here, it's currently at Mach 0 0.5 at 8,000 feet and heading away from me and to the left. Also, up here it displays its heading, it's heading 0 0.54 degrees at the moment and this number here, 1.6, is, is its kind of attitude relative to mine. So it's currently at 1.6. Point six, um, sorry, uh, 1,600 feet above me. If that was negative, then that means it would be below me. Look at this other target. Currently, this other target here is um, 600 feet above me. All right, let's have a look. See if we can find where this aircraft is. I'll just zoom in a bit. Now 20. And pause. Let's go and see if we can find it. So it's. It looks like it's climbing at the moment. Looking at its um, altitude relative to mine. Yeah, at 9,000, and it's about 15 nautical miles away from me at the moment. So I'll put hit the afterburners and um, see if we can see it. 
you can see here sort of an, an arrow there that just gives you a bit of an idea where it is on the scale here so you're approaching the 10 nautical mile mark if that's 20 up there halfway must be 10 therefore I should be able to see it right now I should be able to see its name tag come up so it's above me by 5,000 feet I'm gonna climb up and see if I can see it there we go straight ahead in my HUDs it's what is it it's a Legit National no, CIG 700 so you can see there it's very close on the bottom of the screen hey there little fellow Yep, uh, that's definitely an aeroplane. Bye bye. Yeah, so yeah, the radar is pretty easy thing to use, and yeah, it's just good fun to play around with. And that is it. See you later.